Hello students, I am Marco Severo. This is the Marketing Analytics course. This is the part three of Introductory Correlation. And we are going, uh, we're going to go straight to the software. And I'm going to pick up uh, from the final of the last lecture. I don't know if you remind this. So we have covariance. Uh, we have two measures of covariance between two pairs of variables. This is the covariance between audience score and word gross revenue. See here, this is the average covariance, 3.5. And this is the covariance between budget and word gross revenue. This is 20.38, uh, 20.93, uh, 20 sorry. So the thing is, it seems that the covariance between budget and word gross revenue is stronger than the covariance between audience. Uh, it seems that the covariance between budget and word gross revenue is stronger than the covariance between audience score and word, word gross re revenue. But the problem is that audience score is, is measured in a different form than budget and word gross revenue. Uh, so uh, audience score is points. The range is between 20 and 90. I've shown that in the last lecture. And the uh, and budget and world gross revenue are in dollars, million dollars in the case. So uh, we need a measure, a standardized measure, measure which is correlation that's going to show how the strength of each relationship, and we are we are going to be able to compare them. Is that right? I'm going to close here. Uh, the first thing I'm going to generate is an X and Y scatter. I'm going to put here uh, word gross revenue in the Y axis and audience score in the X. So this is a dispersion scatter plot between audience score and word gross revenue. And the relationship is positive, which means that audience score varies regarding its mean in the positive way, and word gross revenue varies regarding its own mean in a positive way. This is the angle of the relationship between the two variables. It seems that the relationship is moderate. Uh, I'm going to compare now with... Uh, with word gross revenue and budget, you're going to see what I am talking about. So, okay, so now we can compare the angle of the two relationships. This line is the regression line. I'm not going to enter into the details right now. So I need a number. The thing is the correlation is a standardized number between minus one and one uh, that is going to show the relationship among these two variables, okay? so. This is the equation, oh, sorry, the equation. Just a second, let me go back to the last lecture. Uh, so this is the equation. I'm not, uh, sorry, this is the, co the correlation equation. I'm not going to enter in the details. I'm not going to create it, this on Gretel as I did with the covariance uh, because hopefully uh, Gretel uh, generates generates this automatically. So I'm going, I just need to go to Gretel, view, correlation matrix, and you put here audience score, uh, budget, and word gross revenue, and you click on OK. <clears throat> so uh, the correlation uh, between word gross uh, revenue and audience score is 0.42. I'm not going to enter in the details uh, if this is statistically significant or not right now. We need to conduct a, a, a hypothesis test to show that, but I'm not going to enter in the details. Uh, but this number means that the correlation is a moderate correlation between word gross revenue and audience score. And this means that a positive linear association uh, between the score from the movies and the gross revenue. Okay? Uh, the same relationship is a positive relationship between world gross revenue and budget. The budget from the movie and its uh, world gross revenue. And it's also a positive but more strong association, 0 0.71. 
So I have the numbers now from uh, uh, the correlation coefficients. I'm able to compare and I'm able to conclude that the relationship between uh, budget and word gross revenue is more strong than audience and word, uh, word gross revenue because correlation is a standardized measure. So this is the, this is the important thing about the correlation. Uh, and again, I am reflecting uh, the strongest association that I saw here in this exploratory uh, uh, graphic illustration than here. Thank you very much.